Today, we live in a hyper-connected world, a world where electricity provides power at the flick of a switch. But in Europe, managing the 24-7 demand for electricity is increasingly difficult as power is supplied from national markets and does not yet flow freely across borders. The idea of pooling energy sources is not new and was always at the heart of the EU. So in 2006, the EU decided to create seven regional electricity markets as a first step to creating a single European electricity market. Ireland, operating as one all-island electricity market since 2007, has now joined with France and the UK to create one of the seven regional markets. The FUI market is due to be completed in 2016. These three countries are building undersea interconnectors, which will create a two-way flow of electricity. There are already two interconnectors between Ireland and the UK. Funding for key trans-European energy networks is available from the European Commission's Connecting Europe facility, which will provide almost 6 billion euro until 2020. Upgrading the power grids to integrate renewable energies is also important. So, when the wind is blowing in Ireland, surplus energy can be exported. And on a still calm day, we have a choice to import solar energy from sunny southern Europe or hydro energy from Scandinavia. However, physical connections mean nothing unless markets can talk to each other on the same terms. Governments are currently working together to harmonise their market rules in order to create a real power exchange where electricity can be traded. So what do the regional electricity markets mean for you? Regional electricity markets are a step towards the future target of a single European electricity market, where free cross-border trade in energy will mean that power can be sourced from the market where it is cheapest to produce. More competition will mean more choice and cheaper energy bills for business and consumers. Small peripheral states like Ireland will benefit from access to power from a European grid. A larger, more connected market also means that no country will be an island in terms of energy security, with a resilient power network providing fast access to electricity during a crisis. And a more connected Europe will bring cleaner power to the people.